Oscar parties are once again just around the corner, so let's get you prepared with some trivia tidbits about the statuette itself. Oscar heads are gonna know all this, of course, but to the rest of us, it's kind of an interesting story. To begin with, this is supposed to be a knight. Did you know that? I sure didn't. Doesn't look much like one. But that's what MGM art director Cedric Gibbons had in mind when he designed the thing in 1928. The knight stands on an old film reel, and this reel has five spokes. That's meant to represent the original five branches of the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences. Actors, writers, directors, producers, and technicians. And these things weigh a ton. Eight and a half pounds of gold plate cast pewter. Lifting one of them is like lifting a gallon of milk. Although the day you win one, I know you won't worry about that. Finally, and this story's starting to be better known, the sculpture's based on a real guy. The model for the Oscar statuette was a Hollywood character actor named Emilio Fernandez, known as El Indio. He appeared in about a million westerns and Mexican films, before going on to become one of that country's greatest and most influential film directors. So the Oscar statue may correctly be called the Academy Award of Merit, but the joke goes around that the thing ought to be called the Emilio.